I'd like to talk about an example of replay interpolation that actually went to court. It was in the Southern District of New York, and it's two famous acts. One is Sugar Hill Gang, the first rap artist to have a top 40 hit, and the other artist is Busta Rhymes. Sugar Hill Gang have a song called Natural Wonder, and about almost two minutes into the song, they say, Wooha got him all in check. So that's the line, Wooha got them all in check. Okay. Busta Rhymes, years later, has a song called Wooha. What Sugar Hill Gang said was, Wooha got them all in check. And what Busta Rhymes said was, Wooha, Wooha got you all in check. It's a different phrase. It seems obvious to, to a lot of people thought it was obvious that Busta Rhymes was referring to Sugar Hill Gang, that he took that line and interpolated it, re-performed it into his composition. So the question came down to, was that infringement or not? So the things that had to be considered, Sugar Hill Gang, in their song, it does say, Wooha, got them all in check. In Busta Rhymes song, it says, Wooha, Wooha, got you all in check. So there are differences between got you all in check, got them all in check, and the woo-ha, woo-ha versus just one woo-ha. Was this an interpolation, a replay? Was Buster Rhymes taking the Sugar Hill Gang expression and just sticking it into his song? Is that what he did? Yes, he did, but he changed it. To listen to it, you can see where it's on different beats, the third and fourth beat of the measure, like woo-ha, woo-ha as opposed to woo-ha. Sugar Hill Gang say woo-ha, the end of a beat of a measure to the beginning, woo-ha. Buster Rhymes says woo-ha, woo-ha. There's that, that difference, which, which I think is significant. Um, it's, it's changed, it's doubled the woo-ha's, but it's, it's also similar. To go through um, a few more considerations of it, one is to say, a Sugar Hill Gang, the first people to ever say woo-ha? What does woo-ha mean? Or woo-ha, woo-ha? Is there some significant meaning to that? Did, they, did that originate with them? Is that an original lyric to Sugar Hill Gang? And the answer is no. It comes from a lot of, of kung fu movies. So Sugar Hill Gang did not come up with woo-ha. They were copying an expression made famous in kung fu movies. So it, in how original is wu-ha? In, in terms of a fair use analysis, it's two words. Some might think it's one word, <laughs> but it, it's two syllables. Can you own that? They even admitted that, yeah, we watch kung fu. That's where you got that wu-ha. And Buster Rhymes did it twice, changed. He said, got you all in check. And Sugar Hill Gang said, got them all in check. It, rhythmically different. Um, and it, it went to court. It had uh, expert witnesses on both sides. I was on one side, and I won't say just yet. I'd rather you think this out, listen to the recordings, for example, and who would you side with?